So ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we are on the second stage. This is a clapping curtains. Initially, I showed you about the remote curtains. In this 2018, we've come out of this um, clapping curtains also, made right here in Ghana by Israel One Spot Technology. So as you can see, um, I'm going to demonstrate it for you to see how it works. You just clap your hand and it opens. You clap your hand again, they will just close. That's how it works. This is not the remote curtains. It's just a clapping control curtains. So I'm going to show you how it is. So we are going to clap our hand and then it will respond over here. Okay. So as you can see, I just clap my hand. You see it responds over here. So in a few minutes time, it will just activate over here. So as you can see, this is how our curtains work. As soon as you clap your hand, it will just control by itself without no remote control, nothing else, only your hand clap. So right now, we are going to clap our hand again and then close it back to its normal position. So we are going to do it and then we we'll see. So as you can see, just your hand clap, okay? That controls the curtains, nothing else. Right here, made in Ghana here by Israel One Spa Technology. This is made in Ghana here, right here. So I'm going to clap my hand again for it to open. So in a few minutes time, it will activate because it's having a code to access my clapping. So that's how it is. So you see how it is. This, as you can see inside, this is the mechanism used for this process. So we are going to clap our hand again, then our curtains open, then we are going to clap our hand again, then the curtains will close. So let's see how we demonstrate these curtains. So clapping our hand, then respond. So as you can see, in a few minutes time to activate, it means it have accepted your code of clapping. So this is how it is, as you can see, right here made in Ghana here, you see, Right here, made in Ghana, here by Israel One Super Technology. You see how it is. Right here, made in Ghana. Here. So, we are going to clap our hand again, then close it back. So, it's only your hand clap that controls only these curtains, nothing else. You understand? It's only the hand clap that controls these curtains. So this is the clapping curtains and as you can see this is a curtains connected to it. You can use any curtains, not only our curtains, any curtains that you have, you can connect it to it and then it will operate. You understand how it is? Right here made in Ghana here. All these things were made in Ghana here. As you can see the wooden work, you see right here made in Ghana here. You see, so one thing about this curtain is when you're using it in your room and still playing the music. Somebody out there will be saying, oh, any sound can control it. No, it's just only your hand clap. You understand? Even when you play, it's in your room when you play music and you still want to command the curtains with your hand clap, it will still respond only to your hand clap, not the uh, music in your, in, your, in your room. So we are going to try it here and then you see how it is. I just want to prove it to you so that you will not think, oh, any sound can just control it. It's not that. It's only your hand clap. So let's see how it is. So this radio was built by me. Anything that we do over here is made in Ghana here. I built all these things, you understand? Right here in Ghana here, you understand? So this radio, this uh, um, radio receiver over here, wherever I'm going to play a music at the same time to see if it's going to have any effect on these curtains. So I'm going to demonstrate for you because somebody out there will be saying, oh, any music, any music or any sound can control it. No. I just want to prove it to you how effective or how sensitive is this um, curtains. So there is a radio distance. So I'm going to try it here. Then it's not enough to have the light. So this is our radio. As you can see, I'm going to tune and then set for a music whereby we will use it to demonstrate our curtains over here. So this is where we have our tuning. This is where you tune your signals. Okay. 
So as you can see, we're putting it to a certain um, range. So right now, we are going to see this, the clapping sensor. This is the clapping sensor. You understand? This is the clapping sensor. So in the music playing in your room, you see how it is. It's not censoring any music. You understand? So, still, pause this music playing, we are going to clap our hand to see whether it will respond or it will not respond. So, let's see. So, I'm going to clap my hand pause the music is still playing. Okay? So, I'm going to clap my hand, then we'll see how it is. So, so you see how it is? It's just only my hand clap. So, you see that it has respond. You see how it is? You see how effective this cutting is? You see? So, as you can see, you see how it is whilst the music is still playing that doesn't mean when you use it in your room and you have this ghetto blaster in your room it can affect this cutting no it's just only your hand clap that's how it has been programmed just only your hand clap so i'm going to clap it again and then close it back to its normal position as you can see the music is still playing no effect is not taking place almost for a few minutes stand up we are still standing nothing else is going on so i'm going to clap my hand and then so so as you can see it's just only your hand clap that can control this cutting that is how it has been programmed so somebody out there don't think about anything else just only your hand clap okay this is made right here in ghana here by israel one spot technology by me as you can see technology whiskey as people call me so that's how it is